Hello, this is Stephanie, and again, you have made your way to my channel, Saving with Stephanie J. I just got in a couple hours ago from uh, going to physical therapy, and I get all sweaty when I do that, and that's Lola, not me. I get all sweaty when I go to physical therapy, so I went in there, and I done everything, and I thought, well, I gotta get my makeup on again, so, because I was going to go out and get a little bit of coupon, and you know me, I just can't, like, leave it go, and I thought, well, before I go out... I might do a get ready with me. So I thought that would be kind of fun. Whether I actually post this or not, I do not know. So, see, I just want to scare y'all really bad with, look at Herman. Now this is just a sun place. Look, I've got Herman. Now my face is always red. Now that's just a, a sunspot freckle. My fa I mean, my face is just always red. But, Herman had better not bring friends. I'm just saying. Dadgummit, Herman. Okay, no matter that I've already washed my face in the shower with, you know, every great thing in the world, I always will, right before I put my makeup on, will do another makeup thing just to make sure my face is clean. And I just keep this my uh, L'Oreal Micellar Water Complete Cleanser removes. It's supposed to hydrate and soothe. Yeah, normal to dry skin. Okay, and I just kind of give it a one like that. Just to kind of make sure, you know, especially up in the eyebrows and poor Herman, wash Herman. Herman better go away. I'm just saying. Because I'm not about that life, Herman. And I just like to make sure that it's clean. And it is. All right. Let's see. What are we going to go with first? Let's go with, do, 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 do. this is, and it's something I've gotten at Ipsy, Birch Box, something or another, and this is the Ultra Repair Hydrating Serum, and I'm just going to put a little of that on, because it won't be very many hours, and ooh, it's like a clear jelly, ooh, it won't be many hours until I'll be washing my face again, so it's nothing to has to stay on forever. Oh, it does feel good, though. <laughs> but, ew, isn't that weird? A jelly. Hydrating serum. Safe for sensitive skin. And it says, apply a small amount of product to clean, dry face and neck. Okay, I don't think I've ever... I've used the cleanser of this, but I've never used that. It's very bizarre. Let's put a little Estee Lauder uh, Resilience Lift. It is firming eye cream. Got that in one of those little, um, you know, you go and you spend so much and you get the little, um, you know, the little products with it. And I, even when I put something under my eye, I'll even go like right there. Because in my opinion, that's where you start getting wrinkles is on the side. And I'll go ahead and tell y'all, I am going out of town to Florida. I mm, think I'm leaving Saturday. So this is one of the things I'm kind of trying to pack things up as I'm going. So I'm just going to dump stuff in the floor. Okay, there's that. Now, let's see. Primer. I really like this Dr. Brandt Pores No More Base Primer Illuminator. Again, it's one of those things I got in one of the... Birch box, boxy charm. Oh, to give y'all an update, I did cancel my birch box, and the lady was very nice. She emailed me back and said that I had a three month plan, but she'd be more than happy to, um, uh, you know, cancel it, but I had one more box coming. So, I, if y'all saw that I done that um, divorce of birch box, I'll put that up in the link somewhere so y'all can see that. But I was just not pleased with what I was getting. Such small things. I know it's only $10, but what I was getting was not even $10 worth of anything, <clears throat> in my opinion. Okay. Ech. Just kind of like to run my hands over it <clears throat> and make sure that everything is... Sticky, because that's what you want. Sticky. Drop that in the floor. Let us see. Since I am not going and wanting like a 12 or 13 hour wear test for my um, for my makeup, let's do this. 
I am going to use the Estee Lauder Double Wear Concealer. And I use 1C Light Cool. Now, most of the time, I'll put my, my foundation on before I put my concealer on. But I'm going to show you what I'm going to do because I'm going with a light look today. I'm just telling you. Because I just got to run to Dollar General. A different Dollar General. Oh. Okay, and now I'm going to go in with this um, Wet n Wild Mega Cushion Foundation. Like that. And it is in 107A Cream Ivory. Light, medium, warm. And you just kind of open it like that. And it's got the little spongy. And normally I do not like spongy things like this. But in this case, I do. And you just kind of give it a, like that. And in me doing that and putting my concealer on first, it kind of also works around my face too. So in my opinion, because I don't want a, a lot of concealer if I'm not wearing a lot of um, heavier makeup. I will just work that bad boy around. A lot of times if I'm around the house and not going anywhere, this is the makeup that I will use. Okay, Herman. Go away. Go away, Herman. Oh, Herman's about gone. Wish Herman was really gone. This is the foundation that I will use because it's light, but you can build it up. But, you know, if you're just, you know, cleaning the house and doing stuff like that, you know, you don't need... You don't need full coverage glam. Okay, now sometimes I do. I, I will be saying, sometimes I do the full coverage glam if I'm at home. I'm just saying. Like I say, my skin is always red. I'm just one of those. Like I say, I, I'm not going anywhere to impress anybody. I'm just going to the Walmart and Dollar General. Maybe Dollar Tree. I don't know. See if I can swap out this. Dollar Tree, the Airwick, the Snuggle that I was telling y'all about the other day. Look, it just squirts. Or actually just spits would be more what I would call it. Let's see. And I'm going to go in next with my MAC. This is a Medium Plus A55. And just go in with a nice fluffy brush. Just give it a little bit of a set. Not much. Just, you know. Just so it don't want not down in my neck in here in an hour. And see, that also builds up some coverage, too. Herman. Oh, Herman. There you are again. Like I say, I'm not going to impress anybody. I'm just going to do a few things. I just don't want to scare nobody. That's one thing that I've always found that, okay, I need to lay this down here. Hopefully Lola don't get it. Um, that if I, it's funny, when I start putting on my face, I can feel the difference in my mood. And I think everybody's like that, which to me is, is, is so, so funny. Okay, let's see. Blush, watch this. I'm going to use this Laura Geller. It's Baked Brulee Blush Apple Custard. I like this really well. I mean, I have had this for whoop, longer than we want to talk about. But it's got a little bit of everything in it. And like a bronzery, highlighty, something or another. And see, I'm just, I'm just giving it a quickie right like that. Now, don't be scared. I'm not going to leave it this heavy-handed. Mm -hmm. Ooh. That is looking heavy handed, I'm going to say. But we're going to. Kind of scaring me. We're going to kind of buff that back out. Or I could just do this and just pick it up a little bit. With a barely damp sponge. Yeah, okay. That makes me happier. And I always like, now I'm not baking under my eyes or nothing like that, but I always like to have a fairly heavier under eye before I start doing my eye makeup. Because if you've got fallout, you ain't going to get that crap off. You just ain't. Okay, I'm going to go in with my Milani. 
and this is in O2 Bare Necessities. And see, I like that. It gives you like a couple of different ways. You've got the, um, let will say what kind of ways it is. Hmm. But I like when things kind of give you a helping hand. But like I say, I'm not going to go in kind of with everything on this one. I'm not going in to impress anybody. Now I'm just kind of having fun. And I think I'm just using a, ooh, I think it's a wet and wild brush. The wet and wild are okay. The fluffier ones, no, the flatter ones, no, I'm not so much about that. But the fluffy ones, they still blend good. And every time I just kind of give him a sweep. Alrighty, let's see. Now I'm going to go in with this color right here. And start working it right here. A little bit on the lid, see? And then right in the crease. Just work, work, work. Back and forth. Now things, you young children <laughs> in your 20s. You don't have as much sags and bags as some of us as older folks. And so, it's a little bit easier for you to put on eye makeup because your skin isn't as loose as some of the rest of us older folk. And so it's easier. And that's, I don't think I could ever wear like a heavy eye makeup again. Um, just cause, you know, I'm getting older. <clears throat> a little bit of hooding around the eyes. Maybe I need to go get that blepharoplasty surgery where it's, they make you look surprised all the time and you look a little bit younger. My luck, I'd look like somebody that, uh, um, you know, celebrities got face gone wrong or something like that. That would be my luck right there. And I'd be on the internet instead of doing couponing and, and beauty stuff, that'd be like going, oh, look at Stephanie. Okay, let's see. I think I'm going to go in with this right here. Right. And this time I'll just kind of dab it like that more. And then the last sweep or two, I'll take it a little bit that way. So I told you just a minute ago that I was leaving Saturday morning going to Florida. Down toward Ormond Beach. So I do have some stuff recorded for you, so you won't be left without my craziness. Because I know everybody's got to have a little crazy Stephanie every once in a while. But, I just, <clears throat> I have not had a vacation. And I know when I go back to work for my ankle that after being out for so long, I am not going to get a vacation. So I've squished my physical therapy like to the end of the week and the first of the week, so I'm still getting everything in. Um, so, nothing's doing that. But, just saying. <clears throat> Next, I'm going to go in with, I forgot it, <clears throat> a little Physician's Formula. This is the Butter Highlighter. Oh, every time I smell that, that just smells so good. Just a little highlighter, and I kind of use it like a, a little bronzer, too. To warm up the outside of my face. Now, when you do bronzing, you need to go right up in that hairline. Or when you let your hair down, you'll be like, oh my goodness. And then I've got that notorious double chin. Give it a little bit of hiding. It makes it darker, but not like light dark. Does that make sense? And it'll chisel you out, and it, the gobbler won't be as bad. The gobbler won't be quite as bad. And see, that kind of smooths out my blush also. Of course, you know I want a little highlighter. Let's see. We'll use this. Now, look at this. I don't know what kind this is, but it's purple. It's got, like, little rhinestones there. Mmm. Can't have too much of that. Now I'll go in with the Laura Geller. It is the Baked Highlighter in Golden Rose. And I'll just 
go with it a little bit here. Hmm, see? Mm -hmm. Make me look a little younger. Like I've got skin that's dewy. <laughs> it's funny. Because as you get older, that dewy skin just goes away. Just goes away. Let's see. Eyebrow, eyebrow, eyebrow. Let's go in with a BB. This is... Let's do this. This is called Sugar. Ooh. Ooh. Need less coffee. And this is uh, called Arch Rival Brow Definer in uh, O2. So, I'm sorry. And it's got this little chiseled end to it. I have to look in my mirror that's over here. So, I apologize for that. On this part, I start here and then I kind of turn my head. I don't want to look like the old Brooke Shields, you know, years and years and years ago. And then right here, I'll just kind of give it like an upward. Hmm. Not too pleased with that, but that will do. Then I will go in with another thing, brow gel from Estee Lauder. And it's just a clear gel on a teeny tiny little spoolie. And just set them. And that kind of helps them stray hair stay like where they're supposed to be. And then I just run my finger over it right like that. Kind of slicks it down like Brillo cream. Of course, y'all are too young to know what Brillo cream, Brillo cream was. Uh, last but not least. See, the more I sit and play in this, the more I'm like, oh. Let's do this. And I said I was just going to do something easy. I'm going to use my Cover FX on a flat, a fairly flat-headed brush. Give it a little squirt, squirt. And I'm going to go into this palette again. And you know I'm going for that. You know I'm going for that. You can hear my little birds in there chirping. They're going to miss me. My daughter, Jessica, is going to come over and take care of them. Mm. Done and done. Again, give a little sweep just to make sure nothing's gone too loose there. And uh, this is my ride or die eyeliner, the Stella. Oops, can't see. Come on, focus. Work with me. Work with me. No, it's not going to. It is Stella Stay All Day Waterproof Eyeliner, intense black. It's got the little felty thing. Now this is my ride or die, but I gotta be quiet while I do this. Fix my mirror. Hang on. I don't know about y'all, but we have had, again today, weather that is just the craziest thing ever. Ooh. Ah! I mean, crazy weather. I'm just going to give it a little kind of... This is my ride or die. I'm just saying. Let's see. Now, as far as mascara, uh, I don't want a waterproof. I think I'm just going to use Worth the Hype. This is by NYX in black. And I like this fairly well because you can build it. Um, especially if I'm going to be wearing makeup, you know, there for five hours. I don't want to put on some big old... Um, Mascara that I'm going to have to scrub off and I'm not even wearing eyelash 
false eyelashes today. You see how I'm rolling with that. Not even doing it. Oop, here comes Lola back. You looking for another treat, Lola? You looking for another treat? Mm, oh, ow. Okay, you can't do that while Mama's doing this. Oh, uh, whoops. Now, yeah, well, don't you get that? Because if you got that, that would be a mess. Uh, here, down here, snorting. And what I just try to do with my mascara is I'll take it flat and kind of comb it through my eyelashes both ways. And then I'll just take the end and kind of poke it and brush it. Uh-oh, Lola's going to get her toy. That could mean craziness. Oh, Lord, this video is 21 minutes. Let's hurry. I'll have lost most of y'all by this time. So if you're still here, thank you. <clears throat> Let's see. What do y'all think about a lip? How about a from Milani? And this is in the Dulce Carmelo. Mm -hmm. 27. Look, there's Herman. But I'm looking so forward to going to Florida because when you go to Florida, you know, your sinuses clear up, your face clears up, and any little anything you have on your face clears up or any little love it, love it. Then you come back up here and then you break out like, like a teenager again. Because I've already brushed through my hair. Look, my gray's starting to peek through. And I haven't got time to get to, to um, Sarah. So I need to make an appointment so I can get in with her real quick when I get back. Mm. I might need to darken up on that lipstick just a bit. Let's see if I can find something that... Mm. Let's see. Let's see if we can make a real good mistake and make it funny looking. This is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in... Uh, uh, I don't know. Sorry about that. There. There. I needed a little bit more color. Dad gum you Herman. <clears throat> and I know what happened right there. You know, girls, all of us have got a little mustache. And I went and had it waxed, which is what I normally do. And now that every once in a while after you have it waxed, you'll have that little hair that'll come through that's angry. Mm -hmm. So I had it waxed about a week ago, and yeah, nothing's happy. Alrighty, I am on my way, like I say, to get a few things from Dollar General, a little coupon, a little coupon from Walmart, and pick up a few things to go to uh, Ormond Beach with. Because it's not going to be an expensive trip, it's just going to be one of those, go down there, clean hotel, you know, just, just fun, okay? I hope y'all enjoyed watching this, me playing my mess. I don't know why, that just is so soothing, a big old fat brush like this. This is Moda Pro, whoops, nope. How about BMX 130? Mm. It is just so soothing to sit and do that <clears throat> with a nice soft brush. It's so soft. Alrighty, that is it. Now I gotta find my glasses. Don't know what I've done with them. I didn't put my contacts in today and I'm not going to. Okay, alrighty. Again, thank you for joining me here on Saving with Stephanie J. Be sure to hit that subscribe, like, 
Tell me what you think of a get ready with me. Like I say, don't even know if I'll post this. But let me know. Let me know down below. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.